Todoist versus Apple Reminders. Which tool is better for your workflow? Let's find out. Todoist is a cross-platform task manager designed for users who want powerful organization. It is clean, customizable interface who wants powerful organization features in a clean, customizable interface. It's ideal for students, professionals, and teams alike. Key features include labels, filters, nested projects, priority levels, and integration with apps like Google Calendar and Slack. Its strength lies in flexibility and productivity focus features. However, many of its advanced tools like reminders and filters are only available with a paid plan starting at $4 a month. Apple Reminders is built in TaskCap for iPhone, iPad, and Macs users. It is best for those deeply embedded in the Apple ecosystem. It supports subtasks, location-based reminders, tagging, smart lists, and Siri integration. It is 100% free and syncs seamlessly through iCloud. The main limitation is its lack of advanced productivity. Features like project templates or integrations outside Apple ecosystem making it less suitable for complex workflows. Now let's compare them side by side. Todoist offers more control and customization especially for managing multiple projects or collaboration across platforms. Apple Reminder is more straightforward, offering a polished experience for personal tasks but only within Apple's ecosystem. If you're on multiple devices or need advanced tools, Todoist has the edge. But if you're all in on Apple and want something simple and free, Reminders get the job done. The verdict is if you need robust organization tools and work across different platforms, Todoist is worth the investment. If you're an Apple user looking for a simple, rel reliable to-do app that integrates natively with your devices, Apple Reminder is a great choice. It all comes down to how complex your task management needs are. If you found this video helpful, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more videos like this. As always, thanks for watching. I'll see you when I see you.